Hello guys and welcome back to the crazy Minecraft video where today Magma Friendly Zombie has an awesome challenge for us. Apparently every single time he brings us to the village there's someone in danger or someone desperately needs our help. But today everyone needs our help. They want us to go ahead and upgrade this village. So let's take out this book and let's find out what Magma Friendly Zombie really wants us to do. So Mark, what are we doing today? Hello Naveed, we are tired of our boring village and want to upgrade it to something a little bigger. We need your help in finding the most suitable fortress. Wait, they don't want a village? They want a castle! This is gonna be crazy! Well, I'm assuming in every single one of these chests there's gonna be something that will spawn something either really dangerous or really cool. Wait, why is this one empty? Mark, is there something missing? I don't know why this chest is empty. It's not really good news if we see an empty chest. Well, let's go and take out every single one of these spawners because I think Mark my friendly zombie has something really cool to show us. And let me take out these other spawners where I'm assuming these are going to build such crazy castles. And let's get building. Mark, I have a challenge for you. I think it'll be really cool if you went ahead and joined us for today. So Mark, let's do this. Come on buddy, let's leave this village and let's go make them a brand new one just around here. I'm thinking there's going to be a giant grass plain where we can go ahead and spawn all these things and figure out which one's our favourite. Mark, you never join us in any of these videos so I think this is going to be perfect. Well, I'm kind of hoping the villagers are going to love their new place. If they don't, they're just super picky. Well, let's go ahead and build the first one, which is the Pelagi Fortifications. I'm going to build it right around here. There we go. Did anything happen? Oh, it did. Wait, it's killing us. No, <laughs> this is not good. Mark, where are you, my friendly zombie? I'm assuming Mark, my friendly zombie, is just dying as well, which is not great. Okay, we spawned back in the village. And there's the giant castle. Cool. So I'm assuming the whole village is probably going to live inside this giant castle. And everyone's going to be doing okay. But wait a second. That's just one of the spawners. We have so many more to do. Okay, let's go inside and let's have a quick roam around to see what happens in there. I'm assuming it's going to be so spacious. And that there's going to be different types of villagers roaming around. Hello villagers. How's it all going? Gosh, this looks super cool. And what's in here? But I don't seem to be able to go inside. Well, let's keep on roaming around. We have just noticed there's walls everywhere to keep all the evil zombies out, which makes this so wonderful. Well, let's keep on roaming around. And I am hoping that there's going to be some sort of entrance to make everything so much easier for us. Mark, isn't this super cool? And there's even a little canal to let some boats in. Ah, this is going to be so awesome. Well, guys, let's go ahead and build the next one, which I think is going to be really cool as well. But we haven't gone in the middle, so let's just do that real quick and let's see what's inside. Cool. So this is where the mayor or the king of the village will live. Well, this is going to be absolutely crazy. Hello. I'm assuming you guys are the brand new villagers. Hopefully this is going to be a great place. Well, Mark, let's leave them all alone and let's go and build a brand new village where hopefully they'll fight each other of who is the better castle. Well, let's do this. Out we go. I'm perfect, and I'm hoping that Mark, my friendly zombie, is going to enjoy this day so much. Well, let's go and build the Lebanon fortifications, which I'm going to build right around here. Let's do this, and I don't want to get stuck again. Oh, that was super close. And wait, this is the map of the land. Gosh, that is actually super cool. Now, I can hit loads of people dying, which is not good for us whatsoever, but it does look very similar to the previous one, except this one is slightly different except with a giant little border around here. Well, this is super cool. Well, Mark, what do you think? I think this is one of the best little castles we've ever built. But I do want to go ahead and keep on building them and hopefully we'll figure out which one's our favorite and which ones we want to keep. So, Mark, let's go and do it right around here. I'm not going to build any more fortifications for now because I did notice inside our inventory, we do have some different types of spawners, like the fortress. Okay, let's take this one out and this one out and let's build them both. The Lozenark Fortress. There we go. And perfect. Oh, this one's more reasonable. This one's not huge, but it keeps everyone very safe inside. Yep, it's got another wonderful map, which I'm assuming our house should be around there somewhere. And if we go upstairs, we should be able to pretty much head up and pretty much find a little route to the top. There we go. Perfect. So now everyone, we can go ahead and shoot arrows at the other fortress and have a wonderful castle battle. Well, Mark, what do you think? I think this is super cool, but I don't see any sort of use for it. The villagers don't have that much to do. Well, let's get down from here. 
And let's go ahead and build the next wonderful place, which I'm hoping should be around here somewhere. Let's break these blocks. And perfect. And let's go ahead and build a brand new fortification to make this a wonderful place. All the villagers are going to be so confused as to which one to move into. Okay, I'm going to build the Gondor fortifications. This one is going to be really awesome. Okay, I'm going to build it right around here near the water because I'm very curious to find out what it's going to look like. Let's have a quick look. Anything? Oh, it's just built some of the staircase. And I've just noticed there's a bit of a tower over there. But that's all it's built. Well, I guess that sucks. Mark, forget this one. I have a feeling because it's covered in water, it doesn't like it very much whatsoever. Well, let's head to the grasslands and let's get building with our next location. Now that we are back on land, I am going to build the Easterling fortifications. This one should be a lot better than the previous one. There we go. And perfect. Oh, this one has horses. And this one definitely looks like it should belong in the desert. Ah, oh, this is perfect. This is one of my favorite ones so far. And it definitely fits in very nicely with all the scenery around here. And it's even got two giant statues. Gosh, this is one of the best castles we've ever built. Mark, what do you think, my friendly zombie? Isn't this awesome? Okay, let's get out of here. And let's go ahead and find out exactly what's going on with the outside of this village. This is definitely perfect. Well, this is definitely my favorite one, and I love it so much, and I think it's absolutely perfect with all these wonderful features. Well, let's keep on building the Coast Southern Fortress. There we go. Cool! This one goes along very nicely as well, and the gates are absolutely amazing. Yep, I like this. This is so cool. And we can even go ahead and take some of the weapons from here and pretty much put them back as we desire. Yep, these guys are awesome. Well, these definitely go along very nicely, but I'm a little bit scared that they might go ahead and fight each other very soon. So we have to be quick. So I'm going to go ahead and build, let me think, the Dol Amroth fortifications. I'm going to build it right there. Perfect. And cool. Now, this was a little bit different, but these guys look absolutely amazing. These villages are definitely the strangest villages we've ever had. Okay, let's keep on going. And I definitely like this very much. So much so that I might even go ahead and try to move in. Well, let's do this. <laughs> From here, it looks absolutely amazing. But I do want to get out of here. So let's go ahead and build some brand new locations. Mark, how are you finding this so far? I think it's super cool. And I can see that Mark Mafrini Zombie is so excited. Well, we've only got a few more to do. So I'm going to go ahead and take out a few random ones. And hopefully this should be really cool. Let's chuck in a few that I don't think I'll be using. And perfect. And there we go. Well, let's do this. The Black Uruk Fortress. I'm going to build it right here in the middle. And there we go. Perfect. <gasps> cool. Okay, this is my next favorite one. This one is absolutely amazing. And right inside, it's evil. Okay, this is not good. Run. <laughs> They're following us. Okay, let's try and get out of here. Mark, these guys are so crazy and super evil. I'm kind of hoping if we go ahead and take them away, they might go and fight each other with the next village. Let's do this. And perfect. Let's keep on going. No. They're following us so much. Okay. Let's head inside this village and let's find out if they will fight each other. That's something that would be super cool. Keep going. Where is everyone in this village? <laughs> I think they were trying to go ahead and save us. Okay, this is not good whatsoever. Let's keep on going. And I'm hoping that the guy inside this house will go ahead and at least try to save us. Here we go. And let's see if he's going to do anything. No, he's not. <laughs> Help us out. This is crazy. Mark, this is awful. Okay, I'm going to lock them inside. And hopefully that should be okay. Huh, I thought for a second there was going to be a giant battle, but it seems like everyone just ran away and left us all by ourselves. Very vulnerable. Well, these guys are going to head back to their village, and I think I might just go ahead and leave them alone. Well, let's go and build the golfing fortification. I'm going to build this right around here. Perfect. Oh, cool. Now, this one looks very similar to the other one, but these guys are solely based around archery, which is absolutely perfect. And I do love their weapons. Maybe we should go ahead and take some armors that we can go ahead and use ourselves. Okay, hopefully they will never notice. There we go. And perfect. Look at us. We look so crazy. Well, let's head out of here and find out what the next village is going to look like, especially with so many spawners on us. Well, guys, let's do this. Let's head out. And perfect. And let me go and build another fort right in the middle of these two. Hopefully they'll go ahead and fight each other. Let's do the Black Roots. 
Here we go. I'm perfect. Okay. Can you guys hear it? There's some sort of angry monsters down here, but I'm not sure if that's good news or bad news. Well, let's do this. <laughs> this is just crazy. Well, guys, let me go and spawn another one, which I'm going to do is the Gondor. It's the one we have right inside our inventory. Well, this is definitely turning out to be such a strange day, especially because I didn't think there were going to be monsters following us and trying to kill us. Well, let's spawn the next one right around here. This is going to be perfect. There we go. And awesome. Now, a lot of these look very similar, but I do think as we go along, they should be changing very nicely. But one of the sad things is, I don't see any of our fords being added to the map. Well, guys, let's go and spawn the next one, which is the Pella Gear Fortress. I'm going to build it right back here. And perfect. Oh, cool. Inside we go. And every single one of these guys looks very different. Okay, let me take out this outfit. Let's throw this one back on. And there we go. I think this is going to be great. So let's check this back in. And good. And now we have our next brand new outfit. I love this so much. Picking up all these free items is the best thing ever. But that black fortress does scare me a lot. And I don't think this armor is going to be good enough to go and fight them yet. Well, let's spawn the Coast Sothron Fortification. There we go. And perfect. Yep, I love these so much. These are one of the best castles I've ever built. <laughs> and the gates are absolutely amazing. Well, guys, I think this is one of the best places we've built so far because it has so many wonderful farms and so much potential for the wonderful villagers. But I think it's not going to be a great news because I think we've messed up on placing all of these crazy places. Mark, can you find a way out? <laughs> I think we've trapped ourselves in, which is not good whatsoever. Well, Mark, let me go and spawn the last three and hopefully these are going to be so much more amazing. I'm going to spawn the Pinuf Galin Fortress. There we go. Did anything happen? Oh, there it goes. Ah, oh, and we just died. And one of the coolest things ever is roaming from above. This looks absolutely amazing. Look, there are fortresses everywhere and there's so many wonderful villagers now roaming around having such a good time together. But there is the village we've just spawned. So let's go and find out what it looks like. Cool. This is one of the most amazing castles as well. And it looks so modern and every single one of the villagers looks super happy in here. But looking around, I do think this castle is missing one thing, and that's loads of water wells. Being in the desert, everyone's going to get super thirsty, and all the water is going to get used up so quickly. Well, let's get out of here, and let's go spawn the Umber Fortress, and also finally, the Harniron Fortress. Let's do this. Right there we go. And perfect. And, and because there's a dark fortress, does this mean they're evil? Okay, nope, they seem to be okay. Well, and let's go and spawn the last one, which I'm going to spawn right around here. And perfect. There we go. Well, guys, this is the last one, and it seems super cool. And everyone in all these villages seems super nice, except that one first dark one. Well, guys, I will see you soon another crazy Minecraft video. And go ahead and comment down below which one you think the villagers would enjoy so much. It'll be so cool to find out. So, guys, I'll see you all soon. Peace out.